I've been doing Tinder telepathy for a while now, so I thought, who better to get on the show than queen of dating profiles herself, Amelia Sampson. You might recognize her from TikToks like this. Not a narcissist, just extremely real, honest, and I obviously have no filter or self-awareness, turns out. Let's debate this topic. I literally don't want to debate anything with you. <laughs> and choose a different bro! Hi there, welcome to another episode of <laughs> There are so few realistic women. Most live in fantasy land. <laughs> Whose fantasy am I living in? Satan's? You spend a lot of time reviewing people's dating profiles and the chat up lines they use. But is there a weird chat up line that someone's used on you that was embarrassing but did sort of work? Yes. Perfect. Yeah. And this isn't something that you've talked about on, like, your podcast. I couldn't have listened to all of them and know this. No, I don't think I've ever told anyone this. Perfect. I want you just to imagine that you're in the location, wherever it is. Okay. And imagine this person walking up to you and... Oh, you're outside in this, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. And imagine this person walking up to you and they... So they are saying... Uh, this chat up line to you now. Okay, um. This wasn't an opening line, was it? They sort of, they started chatting and they said it in response to something. Yep. Yeah, uh, we'll go for. Do you know where exactly where you were? Yes, well, yeah, for the most part. Okay. We'll go for this. It's Vancouver, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I've written down what I think it is. Um, what was the chat line that this person used? He said, um, you may not be Amelia Earhart, but you're still fly. <laughs> and that worked on you? <laughs> yeah, it did. <laughs> okay, not bang on, but... Oh my God. Holy shit, how did you, how, well, hold on. <laughs> and you knew where I was too. <laughs> if you met someone and they claimed they were psychic, is there a piece of information that would be like your gold standard for telling they were the real deal? Like if they could look at you and tell you it, it would blow you away. There's no way they could know. Yes. Perfect. Don't tell me what it is, but tell me like the general category, you know, like it's the person I murdered, it's my favorite <laughs> pet, or like whatever it is. Um, okay, uh, it's, <laughs> it has to do with animals that I support. Animals you support, perfect. Now I just want you to, oh, you're quite a visual person. You sort of like pictures. Yeah. Imagine this is a picture. Okay. Okay, just imagine it and, oh, this is something you donate to, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, you adopted an animal. Yes. Good, I'm gonna, uh, I should say at this point, my drawing's not great. So I'm gonna write what I think this is as well. And we'll go for that as well. I'm going to be amazed if there's just no way. Perfect. What's the animal that you adopted? <laughs> An elephant. An elephant. And when you adopt them, do you get to give them a name or do they sort of, they already come with a name? They already have a name. They already have a name. And presumably you know that name. Yes. What is it? Endodo. Endodo is an E-N-D-O-D-O. N-D-O-T-T-O. -T -T sorry, N-D-O, sorry, again? N-D-O-T-T-O, in Dodo. Okay, well, uh, I'll be honest. Um, didn't get the spelling, but hopefully that's close enough. How on earth? How? <laughs> How? It doesn't make any fucking sense, Peter. It doesn't make any sense. Oh. How the hell do you do that? I don't, I don't get it. I don't talk, I don't think I've ever told anybody 
his name ever. Well, uh, I'll let you in on a little secret. I'm actually in Dodo, so. <laughs> So with what you do on YouTube and TikTok, you've seen a lot of dating profiles. So I want to try and make a dating profile with you now. Okay. But it's not going to be for me or for you. It's going to be a new imaginary person. Okay. So um, to start off, in fact, do you want it to be a person or it can be an animal, anything, anything like does and Dodo need a dating profile? <laughs> Let's yeah, make it, it Dodo need. It, it can literally be anything you like. Let's let's do let's make a dating profile for Indodo. I think he deserves love. Perfect. Indodo, your adopted elephant. The the elephant you support, we're gonna give him a dating profile. Yeah. So to start with, um roughly how old do you think Indodo would say that he was on his profile? You know, sometimes people aren't entirely honest with how old they are, so how old would Indodo say he was? And I tell you? Yeah, sure, go for what, it. What, twenty one? <laughs> twenty one. Perfect. So he's a, a young man, but just mm-hmm. finding his way in the world. Yes, exactly. Okay, so in people's bios, they have like a quote or like a little piece of information, a fact or something. What sort of thing Indodo would have? What would be his top line? Um, you know what they say about guys with long trunks. <laughs> You know what they say about guys with long trunks, perfect. You've basically decided that Indodo's a fuckboy. Um, yeah, yeah. Is this your, like, you're giving back, like, you spend so long razzing fuckboys on TikTok that you've actually secretly taken one under your wing and hopefully that he grows into a better adult elephant it, man. Yeah, exactly. This is my, this is my charity case. This <laughs> 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 rid- ridding the world of one fuckboy. <laughs> perfect. Um, so, Endodo probably wouldn't use Tinder. That's not really an elephant's deal. So, if you were going to make a dating app specifically for Endodo to find love on, what would be the name of the dating app? Like, what would you name it? It's not going to use Tinder. It would be... Um, tr- Trunkter. Trunkter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Okay. Um, so maybe the lesser on that, the better. We won't dive too deep into it. Uh, so Trunkter. <laughs> so we've got a profile on Trunkter for Endodo, who's, you know, he's your protege. You're looking after him. Yes. Oh so God. yeah, he's 21 and his, his bio sort of implies that he has a large penis. With a with a trunk yeah. size joke. Yeah. Yep. And to be clear, these are decisions you've made just this second. Like we've never talked about it before. This isn't something that you've ever necessarily thought no, about. Before. I'm proud to say I've never thought about this until this moment right now. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Um the whole time we've been sitting here talking, there's been an envelope here. Yeah. No fucking word. Um and I'm just gonna take this envelope. There is one, only one piece of paper inside of there. There's nothing else inside there. And before we started, I just thought I'd make a little dating profile. Are you fucking kidding me? For Indodo, 21, professional fuckboy. You know what they say about guys with... How? Okay, now I especially think that you're Indodo. There's no... (laughs) There's no fucking way! And a massive thank you to Amelia for joining me. Please do follow her on TikTok and Instagram and YouTube. All the links are in the description. And make sure you check out her podcast, The Holy Hour, available wherever you get your podcasts. (laughs) I was just about to say your Twitter handle is your mind safe. Um, I'm starting to think, no.